Welcome back YouTubers, it's Dottie from Ignite Cinemas. Today I'm going to be showing you an easy Final Cut Pro tutorial on how to blur your face. Mask on, mask off. No face, no case. So without further ado, let's get it. Alright, so let's get right into it. Let's get into how to blur faces using Final Cut Pro 10. As you guys can see, I finally upgraded my Final Cut. Like, um, I'm always like real shook when it comes to upgrading programs and I love it. I love the layout. So anyways, as we get into this, I'm actually going to be using a clip of my baby boy, my son Carter. I actually filmed this for a vlog that I am producing that I will be dropping on the channel probably at the end of the month, but um, we're going to use this clip today. So. You want to get your clip and put it into the storyline, the timeline. Now copy, and you're going to want to make a, a copy of that clip, okay? Now to blur this out, you're going to be doing some keying. So you're going to want to come up here to the generators under elements and shapes, and it's going to be the circle. You're going to want to then add it to the timeline and you're going to have a big gigantic circle in the middle of your scene. Now we're going to fit this accordingly to about right there. And I'm going to hide this. There we go. All right. So you're going to want to come over here to the shapes area and under publish parameters, we're going to come down. We're going to get rid of that red outline. So it's literally only a circle. Now we're going to transform this and we're actually going to make the circle a little bit smaller. Now we're going to actually put the circle over my son's head. Like he's so adorable. Like I don't want to do this, but I'm going to act for a second. Like I'm one of those parents. Like if you film my kid, uh, uh, you can't show my kid to the public. I'm going to act like that right now. All right. So what we're going to do is going to put the circle over his head and might want to go a little bit bigger than his head so we get a good blur. And what you're going to want to do is we're going to start the king. So up here at the top left corner, you're going to see this plus sign. We're actually going to click it. And it's literally, we're going to go frame by frame. So you're going to use the left and right arrow key. In this case, I'm going forward, moving to the right. So I'm going to use the right arrow key and hit it. And then we're going to adjust and we're going to keep on hitting it as so now as you can see i'm probably going to have to make the circle a little bit bigger because i'm literally moving the camera in and out so um adjust accordingly keep it moving now this can be very time consuming so i'm gonna try to speed up as quick as i can Make that bigger. Make it bigger to fit his head. There we go. Make it bigger. <laughs> My man's was rocking the man bun, the baby, the baby bun, slick ponytail. He got that good hair. I'm envious. I'm losing my hair up top. At least I got a beard though. At least my son got the good hair I always wanted. All right, so we're almost, we're making progress. I'm probably gonna speed it up right about now. Okay, now that we got that, you can see a big old white circle over my son's face. And that's exactly what we want right now. Everything is keyed and actually moving along. Oh yeah, don't pay attention to the second, the copy we made earlier. We're gonna hit V, we're gonna keep that in the background. All right, now what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna go over to effects in your effects tab and come down to the Gaussian. And we're actually gonna add that to the clip, not the shape, the clip, all right? We're gonna add that there. Now, what we're gonna do up here with the shape is we're gonna come up here and we're gonna go to compositing 
under blend mode and we're actually gonna pick stencil luma all right and that's gonna blur my baby boy's face now i want to let's say i want to that's a good blur but let's say i want to add a little bit more blur to it so you can't really tell his face all right i'm one of those parents right now who absolutely does not want my child on tv or any video i'm gonna add a mount blur it out like that maybe like a 70. yeah that's about right now once we have that um i'm gonna select both of these clips right here i'm gonna right click and i'm gonna actually create a new compound clip and it's, i'm gonna name it carter blurred hit okay and then you remember the clip we made the copy earlier we're actually gonna add that underneath now we roll playback look at that no face no case easy right but in all honesty who want to blur this handsome face i mean look at how adorable he is Thank you guys for watching. If this tutorial helped you out, go ahead and crush that like button for me. And don't forget, if you like these tutorials and want to see more, hit subscribe so you always know when the latest and greatest is releasing. Stay tuned. I got a lot more content coming for you guys in the future. And don't forget, as always, go out and ignite. See ya.